I wanted to give you a quick tour of Diaspora. Um, this is its current alpha, it's very bare bones, and I have no friends. I mean, the service is not active, I have just one contact. So we're basically going to be looking at the UI and what could you possibly do with it. So the first thing that I noticed is that um, Diaspora has very strict segmentation between aspects. So, for example, this is work, and you see I can post a message to work, which is going to get to my work-related contacts, and this is family, and I can post a message to my family, uh, which I don't have any contacts in at the moment. Uh, and of course, you can uh, add new aspects here. You just hit plus, and you can name your aspect. Um, I don't want to actually name it now. And this is a tad buggy. The X did not show up here, but it, there is an X there. Uh, a lot of light boxes are used, many light boxes. Uh, okay, and this is the um, home tab where I can post a status update with photos um, across all of my aspects. For example, testing the aspects. And I hit enter. And yeah, it's it's pretty much what you'd expect. Just post the status update. And you can instantly see what aspects you're sharing with, which is very handy. It's it's this is actually the biggest uh, plus with this architecture that you can it's very well segmented off so you're not posting stuff to people you you wouldn't want to post it to, basically. It's like Facebook groups on steroids kinda. Um what else? What else is interesting? I can obviously add photos. Okay, that's fine. Let's look at the um, profile. So that's me. That's what I look like. Handsome, I know. Uh, you get the gender, etc. Uh, that's that's obviously my um, public profile page. I think that's what it looks like. And what else? I can edit my profile. Let's look at that very quickly. So, my name. I'm going to have to blur up my birthday, of course. Um, photo. Very, very bare bones. Very basic stuff. Let's look at uh, services here. Yeah, I can basically... There is Twitter and, of course, Facebook integration. It's, it's kind of funny when you think about it, but yes, there is... Um, integration between Facebook and uh, Diaspora at this point, and it's actually crucial. I mean, I think it's it's a vital thing, and um, since uh, Zuckerberg actually is one of Diaspora's investors, or whatever you want to call it, he, he actually spent some money to make Diaspora happen. I don't think that this is going away anytime soon. Um, okay, so that's basically Diaspora. You get the basic aesthetic. It's very bare bones at this point. It's very lean. And uh, hopefully it just uh, grows from here. Thank you for watching.